Jackson Jr., the son of the former Oklahoma All-America tight end, former in a fourth and one. Robert Wayne is in at quarterback. Handoff off the left side. Nothing happening for Brandon Jacobs. Hicks some work today in this 35-3 contest. Lane dropped at the 35-yard line. Keith Jackson. Carroll's a transfer out of Purdue. Pretty good quarterback. He is. That's good. Kyle, real proud of him. Keith Jackson again. Five, six guys. There really is, and that's what you love, just the heart. Keith Jackson, that's a game-saving touchdown right in the fade. Then here we go. Keith Jackson. Mm -hmm. Keith Jack, his daddy needs to brag on him. <laughs> Comes the blitz. They hand it off to Darby, try the inside play. Cox on the rollout. Tucks and runs, and this time, Tuberville will fall short. Down by a touchdown with the football, third down. In the pocket, watch out, Cox! Evers, two to the near side, Cox tries to sprint out, the pocket collapses, and down he goes! Oh, tip your hat to this young Arkansas team! Absolutely, and uh, Southeast Missouri State starts at its 15. Keith Jackson, the Crip Hall Award winner. So they're gonna run another trick play. Throw it back, but guess who's there? Yes, Keith who's Jackson. There. Great hands, Keith. Look at the stiff arm. Make a miss, rumbling and tumbling down the sideline now. Coach, 69 <laughs> yards oh, on the touchdown God. return. I love it. Love I it, thought man. his dad, my broadcast partner in the radio booth, was going to come out of the booth and yeah. down on the field. <laughs> oh, I was too. What a proud moment for uh, Keith Jackson. How about the stiff arm right there now? He's going to be wanting to play fullback now. You know that. <laughs> He's got a little background there. Yeah, he does. That's a great job. Good job. And everybody's there to congratulate him. That makes the day fun right there. <laughs> now, watch me. I wish he had the shot. He's going over to get oxygen. There he is. There he is. He's getting a knee. He's got to go get some oxygen. <laughs> At the Arkansas 49, the Jarvis Green Ellis. Maybe a yard. Keith Jackson has 74 yards on the ground. Gets a couple of more there, so give him 76 on the day. From Goa. Here comes the safety blitz. Running up into the pocket, Thompson, and he's going to go down. It'll be another. To number seven and number four becoming an exciting matchup, an exciting duo here for Mississippi State's offense. There's a handoff to Dixon, and he looks. Team MVP John Stocko, the senior out of Richfield, Minnesota. Back to throw again, and in trouble, got rid of it, and a diving catch made. Nope, they're going to say incomplete at about the 48-yard line. Nash was certainly was on the hot seat and had another great year at Arkansas. Second down and seven, Stocko off play action, in trouble, and down he goes. Great pressure up the middle, and it's Keith Jackson, Jr., the little guy, compared to his daddy, height-wise, that is. <laughs> <laughs> Six footer at about 300. Yeah, the little guy? Did you say the little guy? Again, the five man defensive line. What that does, it puts every offensive lineman on a defensive lineman. Doesn't free anybody up to double team anybody. Both wide outs to Stocko's right. He's looking that way and now wants to come back with a screen to Crooks and it's intercepted by Arkansas and it's Keith Jackson. The big guy on the front wall, and you know his daddy's having a big time in the booth to our right right now. Yes. He just showed you some of his dad's stuff. He's good hands. <laughs> Watch this. He's this not as tall as his dad, but he makes a huge play here. Well, he didn't block it, but he caught it. Did he block it? No. The thing about it is Robinson blocked Robinson. it. He caught it. Yeah. There's Keith Sr. over there doing the... Why am I helping, Why yes. am I helping yes. you criticize Why am I? me? Yeah. I don't know, partner. I'm trying to help you over here. And Arkansas's defense equal to the task. Again, a loss of a yard by P.J. Is it too late to get him on the